Welcome back to Wings of Fire Ship Kids. These are some of my favorite ones I've done so far, so I hope you enjoy them. Today, the ship that I'm doing is Clairol, or Clay X Peril. So, as customary, what is my opinion on the ship? If you've seen my Ranking Arc 1 ships video, you likely know, but I actually kind of like them. I feel like, like most Wings of Fire ships, there needs to be a bit more development on one side of the ship. This time, it's Peril who needs therapy. She's a bit too clingy, and I feel like she needs to find herself apart from Clay. This ship has worked in one future, so we know it theoretically could work. I hope it does. I feel like her dynamic would be pretty interesting as a fully blown ship who are dating and not just, as it is right now, a one-sided crush. With these two, I had no problems finding graphic novel references as Clay is a main character, and Peril plays a significant part in the first book. I also love the way Mike Holmes draws Mudwings, the cross-hatching he does for the more protective scales reminds me of Terracotta. About the Dragonettes, their designs came relatively easy to me, as did the names. Both of them are named after products of clay. The one facing right most of the time is called Terracotta. Her coloring is more reminiscent of a Mudwing, but she's actually pretty skinny like Skywings. She's a natural leader and good fighter. She's incredibly fiery and stands up for what she thinks is right, but often that can come off as her being a bit rude. The one facing left is Brick. He's pretty stubborn like his mother, but quiet like his father. Though the phrase dumb like a brick is thrown around a lot, he likes reading a lot and tries to know everything. He gets really annoyed when it, the sun goes down because then he has to use fire to work and read. The two of them are close, but Terracotta always wants to spar Brick, and that leaves tension between them as Brick sometimes needs time to himself. Brick is also one of the reasons why Terracotta isn't failing on, in school, as Terracotta often cheats off of Brick's homework. Here are the results. If you guys like this, I may make more so comments some ships down below. If you liked this video, feel free to subscribe, and thank you to everyone who subscribed in the past. Thank y'all, peace out.